Hey everybody, we have some exciting news. We have some new Mario minifigures to share. Um, let's get them out. Um, there's two new ones. I bought, well, we, we got the new Jumping Mario and the Ice Luigi. I also have another Bone Piranha plant for me. I'm not going to go over it today, though I'm sure you all probably already seen it in the way of the repack of the Boo and the Light Blue Yoshi. The, the Light Blue Yoshi is an, an exciting one. Let's go over the Jumping Mario first. Now, it's, I estimate around every two months we get a new figure, a new wave. Well, except this year, the first half of the year, we didn't get shit. Ah, uh, the, the straps. Okay, we have a stand, so be careful with the stand. See that? Because mine always break. And I'm going to be giving the stand to my Propeller Mario figure so it can actually fly instead of doing some not safe for work things. Wow, that, that hole is really deep. Okay, here is Jumping Mario. He, um, this goes there. The, the figure stand goes right in there. And it's cheap. The arm can articulate, and I believe the hands, yes, the hands do as well. Does this arm move? This arm does not swivel, but the hand on it does. The head can turn. The legs do not move. Most jack specific toys don't move. And, um,. Here's a stand. It's one of the longer stands. I mean, if you wanted to make your own, you could probably do so. So the this is a new figure. This is they took them. How how long has Jack specific been making? Uh, since 2013, I believe. It took them this long to make mini figures. Well, it, it took them this long to make a Jumping Mario. Are they gonna make a Jumping Luigi? No, I don't, th I don't think so, no. Good figure, um, here's how it stands up. Oh, shit, now I got green light. Oh boy. Right here, right here it goes. It, it looks like it's gonna stand. Let's take a picture as well. I don't need to. I'll just use the picture I took at Walmart like this, these stands will snap really easy. It's like, you can probably make your own with 14 gauge wire instead, which does fit, I'm sure. For, for, for sure. Um, I think the, it's helpful, helpful that the, the hand doesn't, well, the arm doesn't move. I mean, even if it was swivel, that'd be a little nice, but four dollars, four bucks. Don't, don't expect a whole lot. Let's go over the Ice Luigi. Now, what I, my million dollar question with the stands is that, well, can I use the smaller stands on Jumping Mario, which I'm going to do in just a second? No, I don't think you can. Hold on. You kind of can. It's really, it doesn't go in all the way. Now my billion dollar question is yes, it will stand with the smaller ones. It just leans over a little bit. But that's no big deal because I can make my own. Let's just go over the Ice Luigi. Now there's nothing special with the running Luigi mold. I actually tried making, wait well, no, I tried making a fire Luigi in this running mold, but we never got it. Any new Luigi is always welcome on the shelf. So here's the running Luigi. Um, it, the paint on mine looks really nice. Articulation is the exact same. The hands do not rotate. 
the legs don't move and the head can kind of bob left and right a little bit. We're in a moving vehicle. And the head can turn. Killed him. Um, it's, it's basically a repaint of all the other Luigi's running. We had, there's the one, the plane, their star, which is a Walgreens exclusive, which I happen to get, thankfully. Oh, it's a Michigan. Ford Explorer. Um, this is just the, um, I really got excited because it was a very brief moment from Toy Fair, the Jumping Mario, because we saw the Lemmy. We, they mainly went over their to their play sets, but I saw the Jumping Mario, and I said, oh, shit, we're going to get one. All right, y'all. Thanks for watching. Um, just so you know, I did get a bone piranha. I'm not going to be unboxing this because it's not new.